Major breaking news, indeed historic breaking news right now. CNN's Kara Scannell is in New York for us covering this story. What are you learning, Kara? Well, Wolf, three sources tell me and my colleague John Miller that a Manhattan grand jury has indicted former President Donald Trump in connection with the hush money payment scheme. This indictment is under seal, according to sources, and the exact charges are not yet known at this time. But this investigation has been going on for a long time. The decision to move and seek and get an indictment of a former president is the first time that has been done in U.S. history. This could have a significant impact on the presidential campaign. But as, you, as I said, we do not know the exact charges yet. We expect those charges to be made public in the coming days. And at some point in the near future, former President Trump will have to come to this courthouse and be arraigned. Well, the uh, grand jury did meet today, even though they're uh, taking a break next week and for a few weeks thereafter, they did meet today and presumably they could have voted on this indictment today. Is that right? Yeah, well, if, um, according to my colleagues, we have observed prosecutors going into the room where the grand jury meets. Uh, they were meeting today. We were told it was not scheduled to hear any testimony on the Trump investigation, but they have been working diligently since January, hearing witness testimony, and it was up to prosecutors to decide if they were going to move forward in indictment and when to ask that grand jury to vote. It appears they went in and asked them to vote today and that they were in there late this afternoon. This grand jury meets until 5 p.m. It appears as though this vote came down just in the past couple of minutes within the last hour, Wolf. Very dramatic development indeed. First time, as you say, in American history that a former president of the United States has been formally indicted in a criminal investigation.